I'm a medical doctor and I'm working in a little hospital in Belgium to uh, 40 beds only, but it's a very dynamic one. So I'm proud to, uh, to present CHR Hautsen, which is the name of my little hospital. I will present today um, an experience uh, on the field uh, called RC Max. Um, in French, it's Resume Clinic Minimum. It's in English, we could say Minimum Basic Data Set. It's a mandatory um, uh, record to send to the authority to be paid. And, that's, and the name of the project is, is not uh, RCM Min, it's RC Max because we wanted to um, propose to the, to the clinicians a real patient summary um, using a standard STEM SNOMED CT. SNOMED CT in Europe, if you don't know, it's uh, a standard terminology, which is uh, uh, very used, uh, as you can see on the map. Uh, most of the, the, the countries in Europe are using SNOMED CT. Um, they can be members as a state, or they can be affiliates to pay a license to use the terminology. Um, so, in my country, there are three languages. My language, my native language is French. And so we have to use the, the SNOMED CT um, in combination with our natural language in our uh, medical record. So it's quite important to use the uh, SNOMED CT in French and there is uh, an international initiative uh, called Groupe de Traduction Française. In, in English, it's a transla translation group, French translation group, and uh, with uh, co collaboration between Belgium, Canada, France, Luxembourg, and, and Switzerland. And this is uh, a, a, new, uh, a new release of uh, a French subset of the SNOMED City International. In Belgium, in Peculiar, we have um, a, a, a map, a national map, in order to offer um, a, a set of description in French related to the SNOMED City Code International. About 100,000 concepts are already translated. In my hospital, we are using uh, um, the system very simply. We put on for the doctor, um, the doctor is invited to choose when he wants uh, and what he wants in, in his electronic patient record. He can choose the important uh, diagnosis and procedure he, he wants to put in a dictionary in a patient summary. So he choose, for instance, infarct, mark, and then it is automatically translated in SNOMED CT, but he, the doctor doesn't see the, the, the SNOMED CT code, but uh, this is um, created in a patient summary automatically just in five seconds, because it just has to choose the, the term in the text and it aut automatically the system will propose a, ch a choose. It, it can choose the term and it's translated, translated in a patient summary. After that, we can use this information in a patient summary, not only for the continuity of care, but also to automatically translate this code in another uh, classification, ICD-10, for financial and epidemiology. Uh, you can uh, notice that in my hospital, we are um, using a more uh, large dictionary than the national one because we um, we use the system since five five years and for five years and and so we are using um, um, a, a dictionary from a, a company BT Clinical Computing, Computing which offer uh, about uh, one hundred and seventy thousand uh, concept in French. So we are closed to the, the whole uh, terminology uh, in French. So 
put simply, you know, my hospital, the doctor, what, what is just as as usual is using his electronic patient record. Eighty percent is just text, and the main information information remain in text. But but he choose what he wants to say. I uh, yes, that is important for my patient summary. He choose that, and this automatically online translated in a SNOMED CT code, we can convert in ICD-10 uh, to, um, to send to the authorities to, to, be, to be paid. This is uh, uh, this is the screen of the system. So as a patient summary, we have three pillars, medical problems, uh, mainly diagnosed, but also symptoms, syndromes, uh, and problems, and so on. Surgery, medical in intervention, and of course, drugs. Here you have uh, in French an, an example of different diagnoses chosen by a doctor um, in an electronic patient record. The approach for us is to say, okay, um, we are using the only ones approach. I have said to the to my colleagues, you have the choice. We have to send some information to the authorities, uh, the diagnose, the reason for accountant, and so on. And we have to to put the same information uh, um, many times for different actors. You can do that that way as usual, but it's clear, clerical work. In our system here, you just have to, to put that once, and afterwards, the ICT will play the role to send the information to the different uh, actors which are interested in this information. For instance, the Ministry of Health to be paid, the epidemiological uh, instance to, to make uh, studies, and so on and so on. This is, I don't have the time to, to show the three videos, but you can imagine, and that's real person, it's not, <laughs> it, it's just my colleague. Um, I, I, I don't want to, to, to say the name, but I thank my colleagues. This is, this is the, the chief of the emergency department, which are using the system, he is the first which, which uh, are using the patient summary. And then the patient are, is coming in a care unit. This is the, in orthopedy. And uh, for instance, uh, the first one say, okay, my patient uh, is falling from a, um, a ladder, for instance, uh, due to loss of equilibrium. And then the diagnosis is factor of neck of femur. This is his nomad city. And later on, uh, this, this person, which is in a colleague, is uh, responsible for the coding in ICD-10 and to send it to the Ministry of Health. And the three, those three people say in the video, oh, it's a wonderful system. So um, the goal is to reuse the data. This is the, this is the main quality of the system. And so we are using the entry for the doctor he can just choose, okay, factor of femur. And then it, he, he's using his keyboard, he, he, he is using the, the key F10, and automatically uh, the system propose factor of femur. femur. He validate and that's all. But he can also say, okay, this is the, the begin datum, datum, this is the end datum, uh, this is lateral, laterality, and it can also give a comment on it. But this is optional. And if you see here, the, the bullet here in the color is to say, okay, is it that this is confirmed with this in the hypothesis or it is not correct and so on. This is a, sta a status here with the bullet. So we are starting from a simple data entry and we are giving this one. This is a, an expression in SNOMED CT and we can do um, factor of neck of femur, finding site, this is, this one, transfer cervical, and this is open or closed, and this is, for instance, garden four uh, um, with this, this code. So we can, we can go to the granularity 
thanks of those data. Put simply, what's the link with uh, the, um, the topic of the day? I am sorry for that, but I am not able today to uh, give a European data space with my, with my system. I am not ready. Sorry for, for that. Uh, we have begun uh, the, the first test that was in uh, 2015. And now we are just here. So we can, we can use a system with the whole dictionary in French. We can uh, use a multi-code facility in one screen, the, the, the doctor can uh, click on all the comorbidities proposed by the system. And we are using the system also to uh, manage the length of stay of the patient, because as you want, as you know, probably, we are working with the DRG, uh, the DRG diagnosis related groups with a length of stay um, for one pathology. So we are using the system to manage the length of stay. This is today. And the next step for the next year is to use the, the, all the data. Um, we, are, we have only uh, 140 uh, doctors, but each year they are pushing on the F10 uh, touch uh, key, um, 25,000 a year. So it's a success. Uh, all, all our patient has a patient summary with nomad city code. And of course, in the future, we can, we can the, the next step uh, could be to send this patient summary on the network in Belgium, because we have a health network. And, uh, and later on, we can send, we can uh, think to, to send those data to uh, an anonymized um, data space to be shared to the for the the research and after afterwards of course at the european level we can think about it but we are we are far from it sorry this is my conclusion not so optimistic <laughs>